Hi guys, welcome back to my soul with Joy. So it's the summer, it's warmer, and you might be going out for walks or exercising a little more just to getting, you know, burn some extra calories this summer. Now, this is something that I made for myself, and I'm going to show you exactly how to make one. I made a headband a few weeks ago. If you haven't seen it, please go back a few videos. You'll see how to make one very easy and quick. But the other thing I'll be making today and showing you how to do is a wristband, like a sweatband. Um, these are great if you are actually going outside and don't want to have to carry a towel. You can just slide it onto your wrist and clean off the sweat. Okay, the first thing you're going to do is fold your fabric cloth, as you can see there, and then just fold it about an inch away from the edge. Um, the reason for that is because you want a way to turn it inside out and eventually close it out. Um, and here I am just using like 5 eighths of an inch allowance. It's all sewn in, and then I'm going to turn it inside out like that. Next, I'm going to take this, the, both sides, and so it's so a straight st uh, stitch around. Yes, it is going to leave an opening, but that opening is more for and um, put in, in the elastic. So now I'm going to take my elastic and just thread it through. This can be a bit of a challenge. So just take your time putting this together so that it doesn't start to twist when you put it in. And once done, just um, stitch the elastic pieces together. And now you're going to fold it. Now you have the option to use a ladder stitch here if you want to do an invisible stitch, or you can just use a sewing machine, which is what I did. And um, yeah, so that's pretty much it. Once you're done, you can turn it inside out, put it on, and there you go. Happy sweating. Okay, so there you have it. No sweat. Oh, like really, no sweat. Anyways, I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you're not already doing so, take a moment to hit that plus button so you can get notified the next time I make a post. Thanks for joining me and have a wonderful day.